7 in the morning and I'm heading out for Corsican Swamp. I'm running a little bit late. Uh, I should have gone for an hour ago, but that's how it is sometimes. So let's go. So I usually get up uh, early when it's still dark outside and drive out. It's about an hour's drive. Uh, but this morning I felt I had to have some breakfast before uh, I went off. It's almost 25 degrees already outside, so I think I had to use up a little bit before heading out to the swamp. So anyway, it's uh, almost a one hour drive, so I'll see when I get there. I arrived into Korshiro Swamp. The temperature has actually dropped quite a bit, uh, probably because of the mist or the fog that is still lurking around here. Uh, it's quite humid in the air, so probably the sun will chase the fog away, so it will still be a warm day. I, I just have to sort out my gear and head out there. Let's go. to walk on a boardwalk to see small. This boardwalk isn't like others when they are close to cities where people take their morning jog, walk around with friends talking about what happened in the week or arguing with someone over the phone. Here people are more relaxed and quiet. They slowly walk through the boardwalk looking around. And uh, even though we can hear the, the cars in the background far away, it's quite quiet and almost relaxing to go here. That's why I go there. Vegetation here is so dense that you have only a, sometimes eyesight a few few meters. Uh, just as I was walking here on this boardwalk, I noticed the movement in the water, and it was an otter, believe it or not, swimming towards me. Distance about five meters, but uh, I didn't have a chance to get up a camera before he smelled me and looked at me and swam off. But it's an amazing, amazing experience.
also got a second chance on you know, the other. Uh, no photos, but some shaky video. Anyway, that's nice. So the pond is uh, covered with lettuce and uh, on the other side you can see a small hill, we call it that, and that's the alligator den. You can see a small, small babies, alligator babies, resting on the side trying to get some warmth from the sun. And the mum laying close to the water, protecting them. At least this year has for me been uh, lots of sightings of smaller gators and uh, this pond was actually full of them. That's always nice. So I've been out here for almost four hours and uh, I am getting a little bit tired, no wonder. You uh, should always take your time when you're out on these places. Uh, you can always rush through, uh, but uh, no use, no sense to do that. Take your time, keep a pace of about two seconds per step. Sounds very slow, but uh, you will get time to see more things, I think. And also sit down, enjoy the nature, and just discover the small things. But, uh, and also, you should uh, bring water. Bring water, bring some sweets, just in case you get a sugar drop. Also, it keeps your brain more on edge, so to speak. Well, I'm heading out to the car now, and uh, see you then.
Yeah, so that will wrap up this year's visit to Corkscrew Swamp Sanctuary. I hope you have enjoyed it. Uh, it was a warm day. As you can see, I'm quite hot right now. I don't mean hot in that way. And uh, yeah, hopefully I got some pictures as well. It's always difficult to get nice picture in this cluttered uh, environment uh, with sunspots and uh, deep shadows. But yeah, I hope that went well. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, write a comment, subscribe, and uh, I'll see you on the next one. Bye.